Russia launches murder investigation after car bombs kill daughter of key Putin ally. The daughter of the Russian ultra nationalist, often referred to as Putin Brain, was killed Saturday after her car exploded in a possible contract killing. The country's main investigative body said in a statement, "Daria Dejina died on the spot." After the Toyota Land Cruiser she was driving exploded in Boisa Vazimi, a small village to the southeast of Moscow, Russia's investigative committee said in a statement posted to its Telegram channel, the investigation believed that the crime was planned in advance, and is of a contract nature. The statement said. Adding that investigator had established that the explosive device was placed under the bottom of the car on the driver's side. A murder inquiry has been launched. The statement said, "NBC News has not been able to independently verify this information." Dejina, twenty-nine, was the daughter of Alexander Dejan, a prominent proponent of the Russian world. Ideology and a vehement supporter of Russia sending troops into Ukraine. Although Dajan doesn't hold an official government position, he believed to have influence over Russian President Vladimir Putin. His daughter had expressed similar views and had appeared as a commentator on the nationalist TV channel Shargrad. Dasha, like her father, has always been at the forefront of confrontation with the West. Shagrat said on Sunday, using the familiar form of her name, the Associated Press reported. Penish Pushlin, head of the separatist Donetsk People Republic, blamed it on terrorists of the Ukrainian regime trying to kill Alexander Dungin. However, Mikhailo Poloyak, an advisor to Ukraine's President Vladimir Zelensky. Denied on Sunday that his country was involved in the death. We are not criminal states, he said on Ukrainian television. Dungin was first sanctioned by the United States in 2015, and was the leader of the Russian Youth Union, recruiting combatants to fight on behalf of the self-proclaimed Donetsk People's Republic. The U.S. Treasury said in a news release last week. His daughter Dajina was the chief editor of the United World International website that suggested Ukraine would perish if admitted to NATO, and was also sanctioned by the U.S. Treasuries in March. The U.K. government also called her a frequent and high-profile contributor of disinformation related to Ukraine when it sanctioned her in July. Dejina has therefore provided support for the promote police for action, which destabilized Ukraine or undermined or threatened the territorial integrity, serenity, or independence of Ukraine. It said in a statement. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.